Master, I suffer cold damage. I am t trapped in this twisted form. Repair me so I can- Consider it punishment for failing to break the will of one human child, Viral. Free me from this prison, Shokunabo. I will make them pay. Oh, you will. I am not done with O'Neill Tech and its secrets. When the time is right, we will strike without mercy. Right on time. Do you always make such grand entrances? <laughs> to an insect, a human being appears to be a god. I am called Shokanabo. Right. And that's the small talk portion of the meeting. What's the job? You're laying down all these credits for a moon run? That's it? That's like using a bazooka to kill a fly. Get the package to the moon, and do not fail me, Six. Consider the package delivered, so long as the credit's clear. If the grid were the actual target, it stands that someone wanted to bring something very large to Earth undetected. If so, we are dealing with a clever and ruthless adversary. So instead of worrying about fairy tales, we need to ask the question, what did they bring to Earth? And just how dangerous will it prove to be? Coincidence. Perhaps. Perhaps they even know of the Day of Awakening and are trying to stop it. I cannot risk their interference in my plans again. I shall eliminate them myself tonight. Whoever you are, do you truly 
believe I won't tell you anything? Then, silence shall be your gravestone, and shadows shall devour your soul. Activate security protocol. The authorities have been notified and are on their way. Unhand that rodent or we will dispense with the warning shots, I assure you. <sighs> Sir, are you all right? Allow me to call your sons. No. But they are only downtown at some fatuous horror movie festival. Quiet. The shadows may have been forced out, but I... I still feel a presence. No, wait. It is gone. My guy have to get more popcorn. Where's Leo? If we gotta suffer through this, he ought to be suffering too. Chad? Quit kidding around, Chad. Cut it out! <sighs> Yo, Leo, where are you? Raphael? Huh? Leo? Over here. Raphael! Raphael, I need you! Leo, quit kidding around! Up here! Ugh! Ick. Ugh. Huh? Ugh! Leo? Hang on, I'll get you down! And then we'll find whoever did this to me! Man, this projector system is way cool. A high-energy defibrillating conductor fed through the older wiring. Huh? Michelangelo? With these horror movies, are they supposed to make the shadows do that? Um, not exactly. <laughs> um, Mikey, where are Leo, Raph, and Don? Run, Cody! Whatever that thing is, I'll draw it off! But don't argue, just run! Get out the back door! Go! Now! Yo, I'm trying to catch a flick here, do you mind? <laughs> and they said I was a rude moviegoer. <laughs> yeah! Hang on! I'll get you out of there! I think you cracked the rib there. Sorry, I was in a hurry. We have bigger things to worry about, namely him. <laughs> it's ninja time, guys! Gaze upon me and no despair. Uh, guys, when did we stop watching the horror movie and start starring in it? Oh, <laughs> 
Awakening. Does anyone have a clue what this Day of Awakening is all about? I am getting really sick of this guy. Now, you will tell me all that you know of the Day of Awakening. And I will make your end swift. Turtle X activated. It's ninja time. Yo, ugly! You mess with my friends! You mess with me! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about! Come on, let's give him shell! Shall we begin global dispersal of the gene seeds, Dreadlord? Not yet, Viral. First, we must conduct an experimental wave of mutation. A field test of sorts. To acclimate the spawn to this planet's environment and determine their ability to spread the seed to human. Ah, no! Must resist urge, but hot dog calling me, tantalizing me. Oh. Mm. 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 Something's not right. This dog has relish. I didn't order relish, but I love relish. Lucky me. Lucky indeed. This should prove extremely. Informative. <laughs> I should have guessed your ugly hide was behind this somehow, Shokanabo. Whatever you did to my bros, you better change them back now! Ha! <laughs> Insignificant creature. We stand on the brink of a new age for your planet. Gaze at your future. For soon, you will all join the ranks of my Kinabo drones. For this is the way of my kind, as it has always been, and always shall be. The Kinabo roam from planet to planet, infecting host bodies with our DNA. Merging with them, slowly taking them over until they all become Kanabo themselves in a global day of awakening. And so the infestation spreads until the planet's resources are sucked dry. Tonight's test of viability proves the host bodies are perfect for consumption. Soon, the transformation will be complete, permanent. Then nothing will stop the Day of Awakening. There is nothing the 
turtle can do to stop me now? Glorious! You drones will spread the Kanabo gene seed across the planet. Then, the Day of Awakening will commence! I got your Day of Awakening right here! Stop them! Possible. A complete breakdown of the chimeric symbiosis. Yeah, and all thanks to the good old sun. Now let's kick Mr. Prime Specimen where the sun don't shine. All my plans and preparation, only to be defeated by mere sunlight. <laughs> no one shall know what transpired here today. <laughs> This is impossible! The Kanabo have thrived before on countless planets, under countless suns! Not impossible, Dreadlord. Merely improbable. Analysis indicates that the unique wavelength of this planet's solar radiation, focused through its unusually oxygenated atmosphere, has a dire effect on the emerging symbiosis. In other words... All my efforts have been in vain! The Kanabo cannot survive on Earth! This place could sustain us for centuries, if not for its accursed sun! But perhaps that obstacle can be eliminated. <laughs> I'm losing my grip on Cody because of those blasted turtles! Greetings, Darius Dunn! How did you get this frequency? Who are you? Suffice it to say, I am an ally who can grant you the means to eliminate four thorns from your side. Behold! Enhanced replicas of your four Terrapin guests. My species' cloning technology, far beyond that of your own, duplicates subjects physically as well as psychically. These specimens are equipped to dispose of your troublesome reptiles using their own skills against them. It's ninja time, dude! <laughs> My creations are yours for a trial encounter with the turtles. And if you are pleased with the results, we shall discuss my fee. Tell me the place and time. I'll see to it the turtles are there. <laughs> Your monstrosities failed to eliminate the turtles. But I do see their potential. I will keep them in my employ. Your fee? An anomaly transported your Terrapin enemies through time to 2105. Disclose to me all Onia Tech data about this aberration. That was an utterly random anomaly, not something you can recreate at will. Not with O'Neill Tech alone. But in tandem with my resources, I am certain we can unhinge the secrets of time and space. I'll be in touch. You can count on it. Soon, the Kanabo will devour this wretched planet whole. Soon. <laughs> Shokanabo. I have a plan that will destroy your enemies forever. My room. Your plan shows promise, but whether or not you can execute it remains to be seen. Master, I beg you. 
Let me prove my worth. I will rid you of those weak organic pests once and for all. Very well. But you are to bring them to me, so that I can dispose of them myself. As you wish, Dread Lord. I hope you don't mind a friendly call, partner. But as you can imagine, I'm anxious to see how our project is coming along. Patience. Construction of the time window continues. When it is ready for testing, I will summon you. Good. I would hate to think you'd forgotten who provided you with the plans to my dear nephew's machine in the first place. Soon, then. Insufferable human. Viral! The time window is ready, my lord. Then activate it. Power dampeners are not responding. Core complex is offline. I shall destroy it. No, Master. Not until it's stabilized, or it could devastate all time and space! Look at what we have here. We should have guessed it. Oh, ugly pants. Nice place you got. Deep down in filth where you belong. Step away from the machine, Shokanabo. Master, the boy! Can you stop this? If you promise not to eat my brains, yeah, I can help. Let the boy repair it, then all perish. Impossible! You are not this powerful! So long, guys. With your friends gone, you and your secrets will be mine! <laughs> ah, what? We're gonna leave you palling around with Shokanabo? I don't think so! No! He's the key to the machine! Ugly? You don't got a machine! It's beginning, Dread Lord. The Earth forces are operating as predicted. An Alliance ship approaches with a small insertion and reconnaissance team. And the Turtles. Shall I blast them from the sky? Perish the thought, Viral. I want to see the look in their eyes when they realize that the day of awakening has finally come. <laughs> How many of them are there? All of them, of course. The entire moon-based population transformed as countless millions were before them on hundreds of planets throughout the centuries. Count yourselves among the privileged reptiles to kneel at the right hand of Shokanawa when the day of awakening dawns at last. And your precious earth falls! <laughs> Choke a nut job. They come in turtle size. Oh, Raphael! Pathetic <laughs> creatures. Surely you sense the power I now wield. This new form is a testament to the strength of my progeny. As the Kanavos grow in number, so too do my own energies increase. Not to mention your ego. Sheesh. We'll stop you. The civilizations of the Galactic Alliance will never... Ugh. President Bishop, if I ever considered you a threat, you would have been eliminated long ago. 
The only two hindrances to my designs were the reptiles, who ironically helped me discover the true path after our last encounter. You left my ship in ruins and nearly destroyed my most precious resource. The Kanabo gene seeds, the lifeblood of my race, set aflame. I am bound to the gene seeds by honor and flesh. Their destruction weakened me to the point where even I fell prey to your accursed son. So I rescued the gene seeds that I could, and I fled. Replenish myself and to rebuild my Kanabo army. To increase the opacity of the grid to 100%. No sunlight would get through it all. The day of awakening will come to the earth in blessed darkness thanks to you. As a reward, you will be allowed to witness the glory of my ascension as one of my own. <laughs> Guys, duck! Go, Cody! Go at once to the grid command center. Take control of the grid and bring darkness to the earth. I shall deal with these fools myself. As you command. The rest of us will deal with Shokanabo. You have proven to be almost worthy adversaries, but the time for petty distraction is past. Dreadlord, the grid is falling. The earth is yours. It always was. <laughs> Like all the rest. What's happening? They're opening the blast shield. Get to the control room. Leo, come on. We gonna let a little slime ruin our day? A pathetic gambit. But it's all for naught. The drones will regain control of the base. Your brothers will fall. You are lost. So long as we stand together, we are never lost! I command you to stop! Kanabo, for good. Not so long as I draw breath. Crack the grenade. Uh, let the sun shine in. Oh. 